And we're back to killing. I don't even know if we in a jihad get... Oh, he's dead. Oh, our previous target's dead. Alright. See what she hides. Maybe we can find something out before she dies. Um... Yeah, carriage. Okay, let's see if we can't destroy a carriage. I don't even know if we get the same amount of uh, contribution stuff if we join here. Like you would in a, in a crusade. Okay, let's see. Spread some vicious rumors about her. Did not find out. But also... Ah, there they go. There are the vicious rumors. Maybe someone else is now willing to join us. Yes, very good. Okay. So the driver was killed. Our involvement is not yet revealed. So we still have a chance for a three points kill. Most guests have departed, and an evening has turned into early morning, yet I and Zia are still deep in conversation. Discussing the hadith Zia just read. He suggests that its narrator Abu Huraira might be unreliable in us, the hadith recorded. Um, sure, we agree with you. That's, that's all, all good and dandy. All right, okay, so the crusade starts and thus we are involving our troops, which is kind of interesting because the enemies of our liege are now our allies in a different war. It doesn't look like we're going to get... Oh no, that's a different one. Not... There's two. I want to know the other one. <laughs> um... Yeah, that's a that's a bunch. Okay, so let us raise our our own troops only, I think. And we immediately go into battle with the people who are standing on top of us. We might get crushed here. All right. Okay. Let's agree further with him because I believe this is about the uh, introduction into the assassins. Zia looks up at me, curious intensity in his gaze. This is not impossible wish, is our art Mordecai? Are you ready to kill and, if he wills it, get killed to defend the words of his prophet and the rightful heir? I am. And you say there's a way? Alright, someone will get in touch with us about joining the assassins. Very good. I believe we're going to get absolutely obliterated very soon because this big army is trampling down our smaller army in just a second yep <laughs> all right okay so to join the assassins we do have to be shia I am not sure if becoming Shia also removes our secret religion Jewish. So I'm not going to take it right now. This means we are not introduced into the assassins. Uh, so we'll have to do as we're doing right now. Which is a bit of a shame. But it can't be helped. Okay, I think our troops were just entirely eradicated. Yep. So now there's a dangerous faction. Let's see if we can't get a patrol out of him and our daughter there. Oh, come on. Let's give him a generous gift. So maybe he accepts the betrothal and goes into non-aggression pact with us. Nope, he doesn't. That's a big bad shame. I 
I'm wondering if we might not actually be more effective at killing people if people just liked us really well. Okay, we shall speed this along a little bit. Uh, having all our armies eradicated in one fell swoop is really bad for us, so let's train some troops here. And let us improve diplomatic relationships at home. That's really not what you want. Not something you would want. We need more plot power, so let's get our wife involved. For the low, low price of 15 gold. Ah, uh, she's the... Oh, we could get him as well. So let us... Okay, we've been studying alchemy recently, giving us more in-depth knowledge of poisons and the like, so we gain another intrigue point here. Nice. Very good, now we're over 200%, which should help us speed through this a little bit. This should slowly decrease as our armies replenish extremely slowly. Okay, let us approve the plan here. We could found our own religious cult. Two hundred and fifty prestige. I don't know what our religious cult might be able to do. God faithful. Let's do it. In order to make sure that the oppression of Jewish followers comes to an end, I have decided to take action. I will focus my efforts on organizing my fellow believers so that we in time, when we are too many to be ignored, can express our faith without any fear of repercussions. So we are the Herald. There's currently no one below us. Let's see, we can induct a child, evoke sympathy for Jews. Okay, she didn't die and people know we tried something. Induct into Jewish faith. Prepare ground. Okay, we can prepare. Okay. But this doesn't help us all that much. At least not with killing people. But that's all right. But she kind of dislikes us now. Understandably so. Okay, the guy in the dangerous faction was wounded by angry peasants. Decreasing his own plot power, which I enjoy. How about that betrothal now, huh? Sound better? Nope. Okay, you don't want it, then we're going to find another duke around us who is strong and capable and willing to definitely help us. So let's see, you're down here. Hey man. How about that patrol, eh? Sound good? No. Almost. You, maybe? Don't have anyone. Let's see. Could be even someone small, doesn't really matter. Nope. Who can she marry to give us a little bit of a non-aggression pact here? Ooh. <laughs> the Empire of Rajasthan. That's a bit too big for us. Let's think a little bit smaller here. This guy. Seljuk Turk. Pafalalovagoniam. Oh, where are you? Over there. That's a bit too far. Where is it? Let's see, you are here. No, oh, I want my daughter back. Press the back button a few mo too many times. Yeah, let's get him. How strong are you? I want to click on you. Ugh. 
Let's get that patrol going and let's see how strong we are. 1,003. That's yeah, not, it's not a lot, but. Let's form an alliance, please. Nope. Well, that wasn't good then. Didn't help us much. Okay. This guy wants to join us as well. Honestly, we're already a known murderer, so what do we care? Okay, so we can expose and denounce her, which is lovely. Which allows us to imprison her. She might flee. She might flee. But for now, we'll keep this option open. We're also going to go ahead and spy on this man. Um, ba -ba -ba -bam. Ba -ba -ba -bam. Stop spying on her. And we start spying on him. Need to unpause real quick so the game understands that we can do this now. And we'll see what he has to hide. Okay, approve the plan to disrupt the balcony. Interestingly enough, by the way, the whole balcony plot is actually something where one of the Crusader princes died from, I believe. Um, a sabotage balcony. It's not out of this world. Okay, we become stressed, which is very bad. Very bad indeed. Which also comes from the intrigue focus. So I think the second we can change this, we're going to go not for carousing, because we can't do that. We are decadent. Uh, but we might go for theology. Okay, so she died, but people know that we were involved. Which should give us perfect a ground to imprison this man, who is a Mongol Sunni. So we will imprison him and we then shall execute him. Which no one cares about. So there we go. What the hell? Oh, he was crucified. That's gruesome. Let's unpause real quick and we are up to silver. We only need six more scores. So that's two more Mongol Muslims without anyone noticing. Or uh, a similar amount of that. It's kind of terrible. It's kind of terrible to look at it like this. But life is uh, as it is. So... What do you have there? You're an aspiring duelist. Okay, that's not the ideal person to try and kill here. Let's see. You are... Wait. This one. No. Which one? This one. He's craven. He's shy. He's slothful. He's not very good at these. He's very bad at this. He's a, a lovely target, isn't he? Okay. Okay. Starting out with 61. Let's see who joins us right off the bat. A good amount of people. Let's see what we add up to. And if we need to grease a few more palms. Could get our first wife involved. For a little bit of money. So we shall. Alright. Okay, let's approve the plan. He will be poisoned with wine. Ow. Oh, uh, he died? But he didn't die on our behest. What? He died of poor health. Oh, that's deeply unfortunate. Okay. Let's try her then. <laughs> it's really silly. Yeah, we still have a bunch of grease palms around here. So they're very willing to join. And another wine plot. Let's see how it works out.
What we could do is we could raise our vassal um, troops, or not all of them, just his. Just going to raise his troop. Just his. No other. So he gets weakened a tiny little bit, and we can throw them right at the enemy over there in the Crusades. Okay, he is... Okay. Let reveal, let's reveal this plot, but we continue spying on him. Okay, so she didn't drink the wine, but did not find out who tried to poison her. We could imprison him. Which, however, wouldn't really help us. So we'll leave it as an option. For now, let's keep on killing the, the women. Folk. I don't know who you are. Sure, you can have a favor, I don't care. I want your favor. We're not going to tell people that he has an imaginary friend. We're not we're not going to do that. Okay, we have improved the demands of our liege. I don't want to support any weird plottings. Very good, another wife's pregnant. So there might be still a chance to get a male heir out of this. Excuse me? We have 459% pilot power over us. So how does that work? This guy wants to have an alliance. At least one. What is this? Okay, so the only way to prevent them doing something is to immediately try to arrest him. So either he is arrested or he rises up, but either way the faction stops existing. And he was arrested. Dismantling the faction, I believe. Nope, he stays in the faction. So, nope, stop. Um, need a steward. Uh, poof. Make it this guy. I don't care, go away. So who are we currently spying on? Her? No, I think we're still spying on our friend here. Can we execute him? No. Tyrannical. So now we unpause real quick and we spy on him. Hopes of uncovering something that allows us to take him out. Why is he so strong? Oh, he has two counties. The Tengri Mongol. Oh, he's a Mongol. Worth something. And we're his heir, so it would be pretty good for us to take care of him. Oh, he actually has three counties. This. Could compose a book, we're not going to do that. Wondering if we should switch killing to him real quick. We have a new heir. Or half brother. Okay. I'm a little bit afraid of this man. Okay, let's see if we finish our plot. If we do... Nope. Okay, we could just increase the council power. What 
can you even do currently? Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. Have that. We can change that later again. So they decide who we declare war on. I don't I don't care. I thought it was something worse. Where did our amazing troops go? I think they died. Did we even contribute anything? Where are we in this? We don't get an interesting overview of how much we contributed. Okay, so she didn't die. I think we're going to switch real quick here. And try and kill him, maybe. Let's see how many would like to join us in this. Not many. Okay, we switch back. To her, because she already hates us anyway. And invite everyone again. Ah, oh, lovely. Okay, we can expose and denounce them publicly, which makes them angry. But we can imprison him. I think. Yes. So trying to imprison him is 100% going to go wrong. So he'll rise up. He has more troops than us and our ally. I don't really like this. 32%. That's not enough. We'll keep it as an option if he joins the faction again or starts one. First infidels. Alright, let's see if she can die in a carriage. Let's someone take care of our wife there. Ah, she is an elusive one. Why? Probably because she's stubborn and paranoid. Keep spying on him. Our wife is in a bad shape. I think we're supposed to put him down as our first mark, kind of like it. Okay, if she doesn't die from this again, we're going to have to switch. People are trying to kill us now. We'll stop spying on him. We have another daughter. Which potentially gives us another alliance somewhere. Let's go with this guy. Every little bit helps. Okay. Um, I'm done with trying to get her. This one. Uh, what we're going to do is... We're going to send her away. And we're going to start working on her. Because she has survived so many plots now, I think the paranoid trait really, really helps in warding off getting killed. So she's now somewhere else. We don't really care about her anymore. Let's see. Our filter should still be there. Is it? No. Okay, we want my religion group. We want not my culture. We want culture sorted 
And then we're looking for Mongols and we want to join court. Yes. And we again look for Mongols. There's not a, a whole lot of them. Make sure we don't get any paranoid ones. Paranoid seems to be really bad. Well, good for them, bad for us. He has zero intrigue and no paranoia. So you shall be invited. Let's keep trucking on. We have a little bit more time left on this. I like that being a known murderer really is just... Well, if you kill one or two people, what doesn't matter? Does not change a single thing. Let's give the famous writer patronage so we can become proud. Come on, people, let's get this show on the road, shall we? Let's involve him. Where are we anyway? Ten still. None of the things we need to destroy. <laughs> we'll just keep him in prison indefinitely. Let's put him in the oubliette. So he dies a bit quicker. I think actually we might reverse course on the speeding. Yeah, okay. Oh, lovely. Soon suffer, accident, carriage, no survivors. Sounds great. Let's do it. Nope, also evaded our attempts. Let's speed this up a bit more. And see if we can't find another wife, maybe. Uh, she's 16 and something Mongolian. Get her. How many wives can we have? Four all in all or something like it? A want an alliance? No. Do you want an alliance? You can't even have that. I think that's the amount of wires we are allowed to have. Okay. Someone knows about our plot, so they might try to blackmail us. Is of course unfortunate. Wife is pregnant. What does falsely confessed faith mean? What does that do? Ah, we could convert to a religious faith, which doesn't really matter. He's Nestorian. Okay. Interesting. Did he convert to something? Let's see. Poisoned wine. 
maybe it'll work. Another daughter. Lovely. She died not knowing the name of her killer. So that's three points in our court. Leaving us three points. Uh, let us patrol her to this guy. We don't even care what they become. So who did we just recently invite? They were pretty bad. This guy. Is going to be our next target, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, we start out fairly high. And we go up really high. Also doesn't want an alliance. We are way too weak for these people. So let's check real quick. We are 13 out of 16. Soon to have completed our first challenge in this monarch's journey we'll just have to try again it appears let's see if we can't finish it now that would be kind of neat poisoned helped with the last one something about china which we don't really care about right now nope didn't work out he still doesn't know all right, so party of highwaymen trying to kill him. There we go. Perfect. So he died, didn't know who sent them to kill him. And thus we have completed the first piece of the monarch's journey. Secret stays with me. I like it. So next up are having lovely relationships with our vassals. Which is a little bit harder uh, as a Muslim ruler because we can't just go all out carousing. We must consider how to do this. Maybe our secret society helps a little bit here. Creating a little Jewish state here. But we'll see. We could actually, you know what? Aha! Uh -huh. You know, actually, you know, we will falsely confess, confess our faith. So officially, we are now Christian. Meaning that we can carouse. <laughs> Uh, we only have to convert all of our subjects. Really. What exactly is an historian anyway? I don't think it really doesn't do all that much. Could request a divorce. Eh. So we can select carousing now. We don't need intrigue anymore. We're done with that one. We could demand religious conversion, which, yeah, he's, he's totally up for. We could demand it of him because he is in prison anyway. So let's do it, actually. We demand religious conversion of him. He is already a for side Christian. So we could just release him. Which just gives us plus six opinion. Uh, best we leave him in there. So next up on our list is probably getting some Jewish council members. We could induct him. Oh, we can actually invite him carousing, but he's not going to do it. Let us induct him into the Jewish faith. Costs us 150 to do so. And let us induct him as well. And we evoke sympathy first. And we invite him carousing in hopes of it working out. Let's check our vassals in general. We don't even have all that many. Let's see if we can invite carousing. Lovely. A whole bunch. Apparently you can invite Muslims carousing just fine.
as long as they're open to it. So a great feast is ahead of us. We should also go ahead and always do hold the feast when it pops up. We don't really need the summer fair. That doesn't help us. Uh, but we might want to have a smith to get some jewelry going. So there's a bunch of things that we might do, which I'm probably going to forget until next time. <laughs>